Hey, what's up? What's up? What's up? It's your girl, Neek, and you're tuned in to Neek at Night. And tonight we are talking about another Dusty. Now, a couple days ago, I told y'all about the Dusty who basically was celebrating that it was his girlfriend and not him on a bullet that was intended for him. If y'all didn't catch that video, definitely go check it out. But today we're going to be talking about Antonio. Now, Antonio is straight out of Chattanooga, and he got caught up by his girlfriend, and he, you know, was not pleased that his girlfriend caught him in the bed doing some stuff that she apparently didn't know that he was doing, okay? So his girl gets home, and he is doing his big one, his big two, with what the news is reporting as special, you know, activities with two men dressed as women, according to the news. Okay, they said it was two men in lady dresses, and they was doing hanky-panky. And the girlfriend got there, and she busted up the whole show. So she gets there, and she's like, Antonio, I know, I know you ain't. You know what I'm saying? Having a rendezvous. And Antonio, um, you know, I'm guessing he got mad and he beat the brakes off of her. She tries to leave the room and the two men, according to the, you know, news, they said it was two men dressed in, in dresses. I don't in in, in, in in women's clothes. They had to pull Antonio up off of her. OK, so I'm going to go to Fox of Chattanooga and give you guys the report, child, because a Dusty does what a Dusty does. OK, I mean, that's just, you know, it's just dust nature. So let's pull up the report. So this is from Chattanooga and I'm going to read it to y'all. So it says. A Chattanooga man faces assault and kidnapping charges after police say he beat his girlfriend after she discovered him cheating with two men. Okay, that's according to the police affidavit. Our cameras were on the scene at Roland uh, last week on Dahlia Street as officers took 45-year-old Antonio Lamar Collier into custody after a standoff watch. So they put the video for us to watch it says a police affidavit we obtained Tuesday says Collier beat the victim after they had an argument about him performing hanky panky with two other men dressed as women. OK, now where I come from, I thought that was just transgenders, but they are saying on the news that they was just men dressed as women. OK, um, that's what they saying on here so anyways he beat her up because she seen you know he was performing hanky panky acts with these two men dressed as women and the woman said when she discovered the scene she wanted to leave she wanted to get up out of there but collier forced her to remain in the room the report says but the woman ended up going outside shortly after that the report says and collier came out there and beat the breaks off of the lady okay causing bruises to her face her arms and the whole nine the two men that was there that he was doing hanky panky with had to snatch antonio off of the victim okay somebody seen the thing go down they called the police collier had warrants and the police came now, once the police came, he did not want to go in easily. They had to get a canine. So he fled into, I guess it was a nearby wooded area. Okay. They sent the canine in and the canine did what the canine does to Dusty's and tow his behind up until police came to get him. Okay. They tow him up, child. And it says the woman also told officers on the previous night she tried to leave after an argument, but said Collier wrapped his arms around her neck and drug her back into the apartment. OK, and he did not release her immediately after they got inside. But I'm just trying to figure out if he drug you. Into the apartment the night before. I'm guessing he assumed that she was done with him so he could call over his two men dressed as women 
over there because he didn't seem like he was expecting you to be back. And you came back. And then he did it again. So that's the story. This is a video that they got of Antonio being drugged. They're going to play an ad in the beginning. We're going to mute the ad, child, because we don't got time. But while they plan, they ad. Y'all all know that y'all could always go to my website, www.neekatnight.com, and get you some goodies. I have so much more new and exciting things coming to my website. So y'all know I have to plug myself as well um before we get on into that so y'all see that watermark on the screen neek at night.com i got some new uh toys you know and the women were taken care of with the rose right every time i put the rose in stock sell out put it in stock sell out put it in stock sell out and i had to get something for the men so i have some new toys <laughs> For the men as well. So definitely keep checking back my website. But currently on there, I have lingerie. I have pajamas. I have, um, you know, vibrators and things for the ladies. I got, you know, I still got some stuff for y'all. So check that out. So anyways, this is them, um, you know, carrying Antonio Dusty behind from the woods after the canine done tow his behind up, child. He over there limping, you know. K nine, K nine jacked him up. Okay, and I don't know if Antonio beat up the woman because he didn't want nobody to know that he get down with the get down. But we all know now. Okay, so if you in Chattanooga, Tennessee, he was trying to conceal the fact of the facts. And we know, we know now. So anyways, that's all for this video. I just wanted to give y'all a quick video. Y'all let me know what y'all think about it down below. Don't forget to visit my website. And if y'all get stories about dust buckets on Facebook and anything like that, that's interesting. I mean, the stuff that hits, you know, Shade Room, Neighborhood Talk, all those blogs, I already see that stuff. So y'all don't have to send me that stuff. But when y'all see the little dusty little side stories like this, Y'all send them in, okay? Um, Somebody sent this in to me over on Facebook, so I appreciate it. Thank you for sending it in. And if y'all have anything interesting, y'all can hit me up on Facebook or Instagram, and the handle is Neek at Night. All right, guys.